charge complete. There you go, Beepo. Fully charged. Now let's find out where Leon and Jim are. And what the hell is? What's going on in here? What's Beepo doing back? He's our, he's our only way to stay in contact with Leon and Jim. Well, he can't do that if he's not fully charged now, can he? Don't worry, Ash. My spheres can show you where the, your offices are. I can send Beepo right back there. Alright, just get him back there. I'm not one to be paranoid, but I feel like there's something big going on out there. Ask away, officers. Would you like me to launch right into my motivation explaining speech? Or maybe you're wondering how I have a device that shouldn't exist in this time period. Or just maybe you want to scold me? Explain to me the repercussions of meddling with the fragile fabric of time. Well, officers, I've taken every possible paradox into consideration and hey, wait! Then get back here! You can't just walk away in the middle of my big moment! What could possibly be more important than getting exposition right from the mysterious stranger behind everything? Well, stopping your accomplice for one. Ha! Huh. Well, sorry to burst your bubble, but you can't stop Aaron. The auction is already complete in this time period. Well, we can time travel at will, so we'll just follow her. Wait, no, no! I thought the FBI wanted to become a you guys here or something? They do. The first time. Upon formation, every FBTTT squad is giving microscopic shifters. In whatever form the designated agent chooses. Time hopping in the field on command. And besides, even if we couldn't do that, I don't think we'd stick around, honestly. And why is that, officer? Well, Leon? We can barely understand you, man. Hey, and while we're on the subject, is that your actual voice, or did Aaron get you some kind of voice modulator? No. She only got me this tablet, so I could come off as ominous more than being that's supposed to be happening right now! Okay, but seriously though, neither of you want to hear my motivational speech. I honestly do have, like, this, this whole speech planned out. No. Jacob, we don't want to hear it. Wait, how do you know what? And, honestly, you know why? Because I already know your plan. It's been in my family for generations. You knew the government would hide time travel from the public. So, starting with your own kids, you passed down a plan through generations, right down to pre-deciding our names decades in advance. For your descendant to infiltrate the future government, steal the time travel device, and bring it back to you, where you would release it to the public in order to better the future. Well, you're not bettering it. You're destroying it. And my cousin, Aaron Jameson, is caught up in your delusion. And family or not, it's our job to stop you both. Well, where the heck did you get that from? Look, dude, good speech, but... I just want money. What? Yeah, so that makes you Jim, right? Uh, anyway, it's like the coordinates I gave your cousin, I guess my message must have gotten a bit scrambled. I'm going to auction off a shift into some rich idiot. And from my newfound fortune, my dad's stuck up, jacket obsessed mug for not making me out to his business. Oh, uh, but for the record, uh, I'm never having kids. Let me get this straight. You're risking all reality just for money? Uh, yeah. And hey, guess what? Well, what is it now? Your cousin got me more than huh? just a tablet. Shoot! That really smarts. Where am I? What the... Are these? Legos? Indeed they are, officer. Little toy building blocks, with which I have constructed your final resting place. Boy, I thought stepping on these things was bad. Trust me, buddy. 
I think far worse than a sore head is coming up. Oh, you are so right. Thanks to that ever so sweet shrinking ray gun, you are now trapped in this quaint Lego arena, leaving me free to destroy you with another present errand on me. Traveling fear officers, right from 30 to 12, it's a fully functional mini mech! Well, Aaron said they're called stealth droids, but I like to call mine the Kill Ya 3000 times over! So, coppers, any last words before I kill you in the next week? What are you saying? I have no more qualms about killing you, Jimmy. Say goodbye! Scatter! The best way to support the Timeline Shifter is to... Share. Like. And subscribe. Thank you.